hi. Um, so I look terrible today. Um, I'm kind of sick. So that's my excuse for that. And this is also why I'm kind of down in um, mood, no, mood, whatever, in how I act. Um, so it's ship week. Um, since I'm not good at, you know, fancy um, photo editing, video editing stuff, I will just, um, and since I suck at coming up with ships under pressure, I will um, only take a couple ships, but instead I'll just explain a bit why I like them, if I can. Um, so I'll start with, start with Harry Potter. We have um, Ron Hermione, of course, which I've heard for um, pretty much since I was six when I started reading them. Um, so I've always really loved them. Um, for, you know, just because they're so, they're just, they're just dynamic characters and they, they see each other so well. Just, and I love their bickering and stuff. And, you know, for the entire, I just, I just sat up and cheered, basically, when they kissed, um, in Deathly Hallows. Um, yeah, I don't know, and, um, they, they were always two of my favorite characters also, um, throughout the years. Um, so that, uh, I also like, I'm very canon-oriented, for the most part, I like canon ships, so, I also like Carrie Ginny. Uh, I don't find Ginny to be the worst character ever as a Titan Fire. Um, I like her. Um, I don't know, I just do. I don't um, I don't just think they suit each other, they, um, complement each other's personalities and humor and stuff. Um, and yeah, I, I just think that she'd be the only one really that, I can not think of anyone better for Harry, really, is all. Um, I like, um, James Willie, uh, which I should, since I'm writing a fanfic, um, mostly revolving around them. Um, so that's, um, pretty cool. I think they're f just very really, really interesting characters, because they sort of went from this intense hatred, especially in the least part, um, to love, eventually. Um, and I think they're both very interesting characters, and the time they live in and stuff, and, um, yeah. And they're all very, very pretty in my head, so that also helps. <laughs> um, yeah, and, uh, I also like Remus Sirius, um, because I think, again, I just think they're, they're, the characters complement each other well. I also like Remus Tonks, um, I think they could both happen. I don't see why one they have to be mutually exclusive. Um but I like Cream is series a bit better I think. Just because I think their personality is complement to the better. But I think it was also a very dysfunctional relationship as well. Um so there's that. Uh since, you know, they wouldn't have had a helpful relationship at all, considering all the trust issues and whatnot that happened and all the crap that happened to them in general, just because their lives suck, and I feel sorry for them, and etc, etc. Um, Dr. Hill, I really like Doctor with, basically all of the TARDIS. I didn't really ship the Doctor with anyone, I used to ship him with Rose, but now, on rewatching, I'm a bit more like me. Don't really care as much, um, but yeah, Doctor, the TARDIS, always, every version of both. Because, you know, the TARDIS is the only really character that's been with the Doctor the whole time. And the TARDIS is a character, by the way. You know. So I have that cleared up. Um, and the only characters stood by the Doctor the whole way through that will never leave the Doctor. And uh, they both have some understanding. They both love each other. In my head. <laughs> I don't know. Um, uh... I like Amy Rory too, because they're very sweet and cute, and I like them despite the fact that they've got a bit of an odd bounce and power-ish that I'm a bit iffy about, but other than that, I really like them, I think they're adorable. 
and uh, I can't really think of any others. Um, yeah, other general ships I like. A kind, Kirkland, I like them. Um, I like, uh, for just, I don't know, tough time to get through reasons. I just, you know, for the reasons that come up again and again and again on Tumblr. So, yeah. I like, um, Sherlock Watson in Sherlock, which I've only actually seen in its com completion, completion? Not all of it. Uh, last weekend, since that was when I got it for my mom. It was awesome for getting me that. It was fun. Um, so yeah. I got that. I really love them. They just have this great chemistry. Um, Benedict Cumberbatch and Martin Freeman. And I just, yeah, every time it had a sort of like, ooh, it just squeal and fangirl and delight. <laughs> um... I, and a really weird thing is that despite that I haven't come that far in Supernatural yet, you guys from the sheer amount of gifts and, you know, just fangirling and videos and fan myths and fan art and etc, 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 have made, me sh have made me ship Dean Cass and I haven't even come that far. So that is, you know, very well done of you guys. You're, you guys are probably the main, main influence for that um, for me so yeah good job um, I think that's it and then there's also the story and uh, I've just been talking to us on and Skype um, and we have been since you didn't make your video due to your sheer amount of schoolwork and your analysis thing um, so but instead of you know just jumping over you in the story, um, I will now read what you would have written or said for you. Matt stared warily at the elf and then replied, Who? Dumbledore? Of course not, the creature said. Rumble roars had must now. Who's Rumble Roar? Matt asked, exchanging puzzled, puzzled looks with Badger and Charlie. He's a lion who can talk. Now come, he doesn't like to be. Crap. He doesn't like to be kept waiting, or his roar will start to rumble, which isn't good for his digestion. The creature answered, starting to lead them up the grand marble staircase before them. Yeah, uh, the second part from whose rumble roar Matt asked is my stuff, whilst the stuff before that is Asta's stuff. I have long sentences, so it seems I always make mine so much longer than you guys is, but yeah. Um, that's it, really, I think. I'll probably think of a thousand more ships, but I just can't be bothered right now because I'm not well, really, and I just... Blah. I also ship Barney suits. Oh, and Asta cheese, and Signa Jason Siegel, because I know you love him. And I'm just going to Bye. I will see you on Monday, Zena. And I'll see you hopefully next Wednesday, Asta. And you'll probably have to be punished for your thing, which we still have to do, by the way, Zena. We still have to do our punishment. Yeah, okay.